Shoshani here. I'm here with a new patient today. Victoria drove in from Allentown, Pennsylvania, which if you know from New York City was like two and a half hours. Or three. It's a ah, commute. Two hours. So part of her complaints was that she's seen other chiropractors and they just didn't get it. And what we observed is we looked at her posture and can I, I'm going to show off what's going on. Okay, so stand up. So one of the takeaways is we take a picture of everyone's posture from four different angles and we can see. So turn around. So we can see that way, yeah. So you can see there's a little bit of a kyphosis here, which means a, kind of like a hunch, right? Head's going forward um, and back is kind of flat. So we did an orthopedic evaluation. We found out, turn to face with us, that she is a great candidate for the ring dinger. What it's gonna do is gonna unload and decompress the spine, which you've never had that and you're yes. excited for. Yes. You ready? <laughs> okay, so let's take a lay on your back. I want your butt right here, flat on your back. So what a lot of chiropractors do is, you know, they don't address the Y axis. You've seen the videos out there of people doing the Y strap. I'm sure you've seen that one or no? With the... Yeah, uh, so I, I don't do that anymore. Slide down towards, okay, good. I think that this is so much more effective and that's why people will drive from Allentown, Pennsylvania to Manhattan, where they'll drive or fly in from North Carolina. This is a great adjustment. What it does is we're gonna pin the pelvis, right? There, is that right above your pelvis? Okay. And then when we do the adjustment, we'll just get it like a straight down so you can mm -hmm. catch your face. Okay, great. All right, so take deep breath in. Don't help me by moving, I just want you to breathe. Good, breathe in. And all the way out. Okay, you're nice and snug, right? Mm, yeah. Keep your fingers interlaced just like that. I don't want you clenching your teeth together. I don't want your teeth closed. I'm gonna make sure that your tongue is in your mouth. I'm gonna breathe in and out through the nose. And I'm gonna give you some kind of instruction when I tell you to do something like wiggle your toes, do something. All right, that's to help distract you so you can unload your spine. So you want to come around mm -hmm. this way? Okay, cool. All right, so we just wanted to document the entire process. I'm just going to move your hair out of the way. Okay. okay, good. Relax this. And you can curse, you can laugh, whatever reaction works best for you. Okay, good. Um, let me just fix this towel. Good. All right. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone in PA that does this yet, so that's why we see a lot of Pennsylvania. All right, breathe in for me. And let it all the way out. Good, breathe in again. And let it all the way out. Good, and wiggle your toes. Shake. Oh my God. Oh, oh my, my God. My God. Tell, <laughs> tell people out there what you experienced. Oh man, release from my bottom, lower, my top back. Oh no. You felt that like release? Yeah, I felt it. I okay. Felt it. Good, the viewers out there felt it too. <laughs> okay, breathe in. So now this is gonna be your second cervical, so relax your head. Don't help me drop this. Drop this. Oh my god. That's pretty loud. Yeah. Drop. This is a little bit easier. Good. Okay, stay right there. Okay. Good. Just wanna see. Now what we're gonna do is when this stops, I want you to turn on your side facing the window, your whole side. Okay. And we're gonna have you sit up, okay? But no rush. Come around another way. All right, go turn on your side, facing the window. Turn it completely, there you go. Push up Let's to a seated position. Push yourself up. Sitting up, there we go. Swing your legs around. Stand up and tell me what's different. The, the top feel lighter. Lighter? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Good stuff. Yeah. Let's go face down. We're gonna do the rest of your body. So people out there, when you'll see the ring there, and I usually put it on a short, or you'll see it. Uh, it's not, that's not the only adjustment. That's basically how we get the adjustment started. And then we do a full body approach. We adjust the pelvis. So if you want to see what we're doing here, we're looking at her leg length discrepancy. So you can see how I bring these legs together. Left is a bit shorter. And then we go into this flexion position that crosses over. So with the Johnson technique or Y axis spinal decompression using a ring digger, we want to do a full spine approach and we don't like to do the side posture adjustment. So breathe in and let it out. Good, felt that. Good, good. And as you can see, I'm putting a lot of force in. I'm not holding back. Good. There we go, breathe in. And bend your knees. Bend, 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 all the way, more. Yeah! <laughs> good. <laughs> Different than the chiropractic care you used to? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, this is an old school, full spine, spinal decompression, body balancing adjustment. Breathe in. Drop this. Don't help me. Drop this. Good. Nice. Good. And breathe.
Breathe in again. And all the way out. P to A. Nothing left. On your back. Flip over. All right, so you've got to be sore from that adjustment. Okay. I expect you to be. So people come here, you know, we move everything. We get, you know, decompressed, unloaded. You feel lighter. And I didn't put that word, you did, lighter. That's what I'm yes. usually here. People feel lighter. Lighter, looser, more connected. Brain to the body, body to the brain. Drop this. Drop this. Good. Right there. And then I'm going to do the instrument adjusting after. And like I said, you're coming from Allentown, so it's kind of far up drive. But the way this technique works, sit up facing the charts, sitting up, is we like to do the visits close together. We like to see people at least twice a week for six visits, sit up straight, standing up facing the camera. So we also see, sometimes we see people twice a day, three days in a row, six visits, knock it out. That's the way it's supposed to be done. But for people driving from Allentown, it's kind of hard to get in. Once you get a hotel, some people do. So people that come in from out of town generally grab a hotel, spend a couple nights in Manhattan, go shopping, go to lunch, then they come in and get adjusted. All right, stand up and walk around and tell me what, because you said you were five when you came in. Where are you now? More finer, <laughs> more better. More better, like what yeah. number? Pretty much like everything feels loose. So like a zero, no hand? Yeah. Right now, nice and simple. You ready, you ready to go? Yeah. Happy? Yeah, I am. Excited. Good stuff. All right, great. So, good stuff. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks.